Paul, could you tell us, uh, before you get into the La Higuera, if you can tell me about the IOCG belt, why that's significant, and then if you could jump into your key assets. Yeah, sure. So, look, I, I, IOCG, a lot of your listeners may not um, be familiar with this, but IOCG is the acronym for Iron Oxide Copper Gold um, Deposits, okay? So, you know, cop, cop, copper... Copper production 101. Uh, there are there are typically about three styles of, of copper deposits that, that are significant globally. And the first is obviously porphyry copper deposits that everybody's familiar with, which produce say say about 75 to 80 percent of the world's copper. And then there are sediment hosted um, copper deposits, which are the things uh, like the Democratic Republic of Congo, etc., and the African Copper Belt, and they produce sort of 10 or 15 percent of the world's uh, copper. And the the, the rest um, predominantly comes from these iron oxide copper gold. Deposits. Deposits and a little bit from from um, VHMS, volcanic hosted massive sulfide deposits. 